Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. Just a quick note before getting into this short video to say that I'm currently in the process of splitting up my channel into various different channels. One of them is going to be called Daniel's Tech World. It's already set up, but I'm just finishing some things regarding it. And that's where you're gonna be able to find going forward videos about Ubuntu and Caden Live and other topics of that nature. So now let's get into the actual video. Okay, in order to manually set the link speed on your ethernet connection in Ubuntu, you wanna go down to the bottom right of the corner and click on edit connections in your network manager GUI. Then you're going to wanna to find your internet connection and click on the settings cog wheel. If it's not there, then you can add it by clicking on the plus symbol and creating an ethernet connection, but it's here. So clicking on setting on the first page, you're going to be taken to the main ethernet settings. And this is where you can change things to manually set a static link speed for this ethernet connection. Under link negotiation, you can choose ignore or manual. In this case, we're going to select manual. And then in the speed, you have four options, 10 Mbps, 100, one gigabit for a gigabit throughput, and even 10 gigabits per second. And you can also manually set the duplex between full and half. Click on save and those parameters should be saved and you've now created a manual static link speed for this ethernet connection in your Ubuntu computer. Just remember that this is setting up something on the software level. In most cases, if you, it's best to leave your link speed to automatic and it works out of the box. But if for, if for whatever reason you want to do it manually, this is it. But you do need to make sure that the network interface controller, the NIC supports gigabit throughput or above on its ports because nothing you change on the software level can make that work if it's if the hardware doesn't support it thanks for watching this video if you want to get more videos from me feel free to subscribe to this youtube channel